Francisco, and today I'm going to be showing you how and why to adjust your Spectre tone pump. If you're already familiar with the tone pump and you just want to see how to adjust it, then I'll put a time on the screen on where to forward to to start the adjustment. If your Euro was built prior to 2008, your tone pump will not have a trim pot, so you won't be able to adjust it. In order to find out what year you have, you just use your serial number, and I will put a link in the description box to a matrix on how to do that. What is a Spectre Tone Pump? A Spectre Tone Pump is a JFET circuit, which basically means when it's overloaded, there's no signal loss, and that helps it to cut through the mix, and it sounds incredible, and it's really powerful, and sometimes very loud. To understand what I mean, let's check out some other active basses. This is a Zonsonis. All of the basses will be at the same volume on this amp. I'm using the Ampeg Micro VR, which I love. Stingray, all knobs up. Let's check out a passive bass, because why not? Thunder Jazz. <laughs> Let's hear the Spectre TW35 at all the same volume. As you can see, it's quite louder than the other basses, and that's okay, because if you're just playing live, it's great. No big deal. So let's go in the studio and see how the tone pump affects our signal. Okay, here's my signal prior to adjusting the tone pump. As you can see, it's out of control. It's way too hot. Here's my signal prior to adjusting the tone pump, but just turning down the volume knobs and, in effect, sacrificing tone. Here's my signal after adjusting the tone pump, it's much more of a controllable level without sacrificing tone. Okay, ready? This is super easy. All you're gonna need is a Phillips head screwdriver, remove the back plate, which I've already done. And there's the tone pump right there, Spectre tone pump. You can see mine is installed to where it looks like it's upside down. Yours may be installed differently, but once you turn the level, you'll be able to hear the difference. If I turn it clockwise from my direction, it's going to turn it up, so I actually want to turn it down. So I'm just going to turn it one quarter turn to the left, which is counterclockwise, which turns it down. So I just turned it once, like a quarter turn. Let's hear how that sounds. I'm going to play you the final bass tone after adjusting the tone pump. So have fun with your Spectre, and please subscribe so you can join me on all my base adventures. Can we just talk about my nail polish for a second, because it's amazing. <laughs>